good morning i just dropped Mauricio off at work we have a long day ahead of us but first we have to get my blood work done i was going to get it done later but Mauricio's work was literally like two minutes away from the blood work place so i was like let's just knock it out so we're here at lab corp we're getting my blood drawn they're testing for estrogen fsh lh um making sure i'm not pregnant so um hcg and then estradol estradiol i don't know how to say that word but so let's go their stat order so hopefully we have the results by the end of the day so that's really nice because i've never had stat blood work orders before so feel a little fancy you know blood work is done and now we're going to get coffee and donuts it's 8 30 now i need to leave the rv by like 11 so i have plenty of time plenty of time Dunkin' Donuts, we're gonna go get coffee and then we're gonna come back and bring some to Mauricio and then we're gonna head home. So, next stop, Dunkin' Donuts. Making my way around a new city and I have no clue where I'm going. Yeah. Hello, can I get two large caramel iced coffees with cream? Two large iced caramel coffees with cream? And then a strawberry sprinkle donut if you have it. The one today? Yes. Anything else? That's it. Thank you. I always put my camera up. I always put my camera up like when I grab the food, but I'm like, it's fine, girl. Just do it. Like, so I'm going to leave the camera rolling today. And yeah, I'm just going to do that. I'm going to face my fears. I'm going to face my fears with vlogging and broaden my horizons. I want to be able to like run through Target just talking to a camera and pay no mind, but I pay so much mind. So, luckily, it's not like, I can't wait to have my SUV back where it's not freaking this massive of a car. Good morning. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. You as well. What, baby? I hope she gave me straws. They did perfection. Thank you. I want donuts. I know, baby. I got it right here. Here's your strawberry donut. Okay. Now we're heading to back to Mauricio's work, which I have no idea where it's at. I found Publix, though and ninja sushi thai the only place the only problem with my camera right here one it's safer but well that's a good thing one thing that's bad about it is that i'm cut off by the wheel because i'm so short but we'll have to make do i'm editing the vlog right now and there's a clip missing i thought i recorded it on my phone but it's not on my phone it's not like in my deleted or anything so i have no idea what happened to it but anyways what you're about to see is me going to take Mauricio his coffee. I go inside the store. I give him his coffee. We meet his coworkers. As I'm leaving, I'm like, did I give you the keys? And he says no. And I'm like, okay, I guess I left them in the car. So I walk out to the truck. The truck's locked. I look in the seat. There's no, like, in through the window. There's no keys. So I call Mauricio and just say, like, the keys are not in the truck. The truck is locked. And then I start following my footsteps back tracing them through the store and they are not there um and then I waited we called triple a and I ended up having to wait with Lilia in the heat for about an hour because she was being so bad in the store so I didn't want to stay in the store and the store was also super hot like it wasn't any cooler than it was outside and so the clip you're about to see is after triple a came and let me in the truck and I'll let past tense Amanda catch up from there okay we got into the car but the keys are not in here so I don't know what to do from here I mean we have a spare at the RV but I don't know how to get to the spare because this is our only vehicle so I just had to reschedule my genetic testing so that makes me kind of upset because it just it takes three weeks to get it done not like it's gonna make a huge difference like one business day but you know God, and, me. and it's Mommy like over the weekend because you know on friday they're probably not gonna start it anyways they'll probably start it on monday with mondays so i'm trying to think like that but at the same time like it's just very irritating that i did this and like i can't believe that 
I was so dumb. Thank you, thank you, mama. You're welcome, baby, it's not even for you. Luckily, Mauricio's coworker is super nice and offered to drive us, drive one of us to the RV to get the keys, but I just feel so guilty because I'm at his work and he like just started here and like what a great first impression. <laughs> like, And it's like ridiculously hot in here, so I don't know. No, you want keys. Those aren't my keys, baby. I want them. But I'm just frustrated with myself. I was looking forward to like going to Orlando and possibly like going to Disney Springs with Lilia and going like to Disney store and just spending a good day with her, but. Mommy, Mama, you size. Instead, <laughs> lost the freaking keys. In an expensive key at that, it's not like I can just go get another one cut. Like, it's a fucking push to start. Who invented push to start keys? They're dumb. Oh, welcome. Hi, Lori. Hi, Noon. Hello. Come on, baby. Is that it? See, my girl. Oh, mommy? Here? Yeah. Oh, welcome. You're welcome. You gonna talk to him? Oh my god, she even pressed record. Did you turn it on yourself? A dobby boat. Don't take him apart, baby. Can you hear me, mommy's camera? No. Oh, welcome. What did you say? A welcome. Welcome. You know you're only getting away with right, that right now because we're stuck in the car. A yummy. And it's the only thing mommy has to drink. Ooh, coffee? Mm-hmm. I have a new Adobe boot. You're awake. I'm gone. So I'm gonna go ow, ow, with Joni to go get to the RV. I'm hoping it's still right. I'm pretty sure it's on the, the rack right there. Mm -hmm. It just sucks because the sun's blaring in. Do you want me to put the sunshade up? If you want, yeah, I'm gonna do that. Ever since I got home from the whole fiasco of me losing the keys, I literally felt like doing nothing and just becoming one with the couch because I was so disappointed in myself. But I did have to get up and go pick up Mauricio from work because I was supposed to be going to Orlando today and I couldn't go because I have the keys. Anyways, we stopped and got a couple of groceries. We went to Publix and let me tell you, the cereal was $8 a box and you will never catch me going to Publix again because that's insane because I used to shop at Aldi and I got groceries delivered last week for the entire week from Aldi here on Instacart and with tip and the delivery fees and even the higher prices of Aldi like on the Instacart app, I paid less money. So go to Aldi, okay? I got restaurant style fries for dinner tonight because I got literally dinner just for tonight there. I got some juice for Lilia. I did get her a bunch of lunch items. So she's been eating SpaghettiOs and I guess I haven't talked about this a lot, but Lilia does not eat a lot of food, so I'm buying what she likes to eat. I got her sweet peas because she likes those. No salt added. No salt added sweet peas. Um, Chef Boyardee. I also got her like this princess soup. She likes the princess soup. And then she got a Paw Patrol soup. And then spaghettis were like on sale for like four for five dollars. So we did pick up those and then we picked up um, garlic powder because we needed more. And I think that's what we needed, right? Did you find her in the next bag? It's not like she could go far without us seeing. It's pretty open here. Um, I got cheese strings because they were also buy one, get one. Um, I got some tea for boba. I just like the milk tea, though. Not boba. These were on sale. 25% less sodium, so Mauricio grabbed them. 
and he got some Chobani yogurts, which also were on sale. And then he also got these, so these three more of these, or two more of these, these were on sale. Because I guess they may be because they're damaged, I don't know. And then some strawberries, because Bill Lily's been loving strawberries lately, so I got two packs today. I usually just get one, but I got two today. Put this away, and then we'll do the next bags. Next ba bag, we have bread, which was also on sale, which is why we got that. Um, I can't make bread in the RV, so have to buy bread. But I also got bread flour, because my best friend got me, or gifted me some of her bread flour starter. So I needed bread flour, because she gave me some bread flour, but I don't know where it's at. I do not know. So anyways, that's in that bag. I'm probably gonna freeze one of these if it fits. Um, this next bag, I got some salted caramel cream um, flavoring for my coffee. Probably some chocolate milk, espresso, and avocados. And minion cookies. I'm gonna show you guys how sketchy you guys are, where you guys are sitting at. It's a very sketchy place to put the camera. <clears throat> that trash was so stinky. It had starter in it, but I think it had something else in it too. Huh? Some more milk. So we're gonna put these away. Sit here anymore. Yeah. Well, take the out. Huh? Take the out. I don't even know how you're gonna cook that. Figure it out. Are you serious? Yeah. Why? Right. How are you gonna put that in the pressure cooker? Figure it out. That's not gonna happen. I don't know, baby. <laughs> but you. frozen. Do you think that this could be defrosted tonight in the pressure cooker? Are we gonna have it tomorrow? Okay, I can pull it out for tomorrow, but like. What are we gonna have for dinner? I just can't. If we had like a full blown oven, you could like slowly, well, slowly defrost it, maybe like in a microwave, how you do it, but that's giving me frost burn with how cold it is. <laughs> Which one do you want first? This one. I guess we're doing power seats. Yeah, this one. Before I take it apart, this is what you guys were standing on. Hold on, let me put it back. You want some? Yeah, a cup. Risque. Mm -hmm. 